So the next part of my programming that I do is I start defining what we call work bits. We know in our program that we're going to have certain things that have to happen and we have to program those. Machines don't go into auto just because you flip the switch to auto. It's been programmed to go into auto. Machines don't work in manual just because you flip the switch to manual. They've been programmed to work in manual. So with a station like this and every one of these stations in here, we know there's certain modes of operation that we're going to need. We need auto mode. We need manual mode. We need reset mode. We're going to need a home position. We're going to need a start button that's going to initiate things. We might need a parts passed. We might need a parts failed. All those are considered work bits. So at this point, you have to think about on the station, how do you want to control it? And those are going to be used as internal bits in our PLC program. So again, now I used B3 colon zero in the previous addressing of our cylinder positions. So now I'm going to use B3 colon one because it's the next available word in the series. So B3 colon one slash zero and I hit enter and yes, you guessed it again, I'm going to auto fill because it eliminates errors and then I can get 15 bits of information that I plan to use. Okay, status again, we're just going to do a zero and we're going to auto fill that. Okay, so now we've got all of our bits in that we're going to program. Now we just have to think of how do we want to control the station. Well, first of all, we're going to need a home position. What is a home position? A home position is a starting position for the station. So each and every actuator is in its home state. So we know everything is prepared and everything is ready to go. That is known as a home position. So under symbol, I'm going to do home. position and description is just home position. Okay, so what else do we need this station to do? Well, we know we need auto mode. So let's program a bit as auto mode. We're going to type auto mode. And over here, we'll do the same thing. We'll call it auto mode as the description. Well, if you've got auto mode, then you may need manual mode as well. So we're going to put our symbol in as manual underscore mode. And then the description is going to be manual mode. So we've got home position, auto mode, manual mode. Well, what happens if something goes wrong and we need to get the actuators back to where they need to go? we need to do reset mode. Okay, so I'm going to program what's called reset mode to an internal bit of B3 colon 1, 3. Now you as the programmer, you can choose any bit that you want. I typically like to start with a bit series and then just keep going B3, 0, B3, 1, B3, 2, B3, 3, et cetera, et cetera. So this being now the description for reset mode. Okay, so I got home position, auto mode, manual mode, reset mode. Well, if you've got all those, you need one way to start the station. So we have a start button on the actual station, but I'm going to program it to a bit. So I'm going to say start underscore PB, which is my symbol, and then again in my description, I could call it start push button, I could call it start PB. I'm just going to stick with start PB. Okay, and I'm also going to need a one shot condition in my program. And we'll talk about one shot later as we continue programming. But for this one, we don't want a symbol. We're just going to call this start PB. And we're going to call this an OS for one shot. Okay, we're going to need an initiate cycle. 
We're also going to need a part passed and we're going to need a part failed. So I will go ahead and do initiate cycle, which is going to be B3 colon 1, 6. And I'm going to put that in as a symbol of initiate cycle. And a description will be the same, initiate cycle, which will actually start the process off. When we continue on, you're also going to need a parts passed, a parts failed, and you will probably have more work bits that you're going to want to put in here. But for now, that will handle all of our work bits.